Uh, coming from somebody that uses both, I think that it might be hard to think about how people choose to use Markdown and not choose, choose to use LaTeX when I think all of you, your first experience was with LaTeX and then Markdown came second. And it's a little bit different when the user experience has never seen LaTeX. Most of the time, it's not because somebody is choosing that they don't want to use one or the other. It's that they've seen the output from Markdown and they see that as being either simpler or producing a better product than what they currently use. And so it's not, and then the benefit of Markdown to, in response to your comment, Philip, about uh, not being able to use features of LaTeX is you can is you can port almost anything from Markdown and just write it in LaTeX, but have it in a Markdown file. And so the functionality is there. It's just if you want to use it or not. But I think the biggest thing is that users need to see either LaTeX or Markdown as being easier to use than whatever they're currently using. Otherwise, they're not gonna switch. And so going back to the comment about it being fun, um, I, I think is what your description was, uh, is that it ha you have to show the comparison. And Markdown's done a great job about advertising. And the thing about having you know, all that front matter before you see words on a page, Overleaf is trying to change that. Our studio is trying to change that, where as you type words on the page, you automatically see them being rendered. And I think that that has created a lot of new users. Uh, and just I don't think very many of you use our studio, which is the GUI that uh, comes packaged with R if you want it. And they have a dynamic, you can type and be writing code and text and it'll render for you as you're typing. And so you can have a terminal window that's open that's executing the math or the optimization routine and then have another window at the top that's showing what your output into your PDF or HTML would be all while you're typing without uh, having to have thought in going to a command line and actually rendering the document. 